Hey guys, it's Debbie here. Welcome back to another tutorial. So today we are going to be creating this look that I have on right here using all drugstore products. Drugstore products, I feel like they're really like, they've improved over the years. Like the quality is really nice and I don't know, it's really affordable. Before we get into it, please make sure to hit that subscribe button. Make sure to turn on your post notification bell and please give this video a big thumbs up if you end up enjoying it. Let's just go ahead and get into it. Okay guys, so like I mentioned, uh, so I'm going to be doing, I'm gonna be using all drugstore products. Some are kind of like new and some like I already like had and stuff like that. Excuse me, okay, because I have like no brows. But yeah, let's not focus on that. So basically, for my brows, that's why I don't have my brows done because I'm going to be using drugstore products to do my brows. Okay, guys, so now I am just going in with the Elf Cosmetic Instant Lift Brow in the shade Auburn. So the shade is a little bit like, it's really like light brown and my brows are kind of like a little bit darker. So I'm just going to go in with a different brow pencil and kind of like add to that. So this one is not drugstore. This is the Fancy's uh, brow pencil. I'm just going to like add it on top of that because... So to conceal my brows. I'm gonna go in with the Maybelline Fit Me Concealer in the shade 40. This one is caramel. As much as I love, as much as I love Maybelline, <laughs> I'm so guilty of like never trying uh, the concealer. Like I always wanna get it, but like, I don't know, I've just never tried it. So this is like my first time actually using this concealer okay so so that is done this is a brows i am in love okay this looks so soft um so this is the part where <laughs> i don't have any drugstore primer and i have my reasons why i don't not that they're not good or anything but like I just have a bad experience with like drugstore primer. Um, I don't know. I feel like I just haven't found the one that's like really good. I've tried one from e.l.f. and Maybelline, but they, my skin reacted really badly to it. So yeah. So you guys let me know in the comments if you have any primer recommendations that are really good and that will not mess up my face okay i'm like looking forward to investing in one of those good primers from the drugstore but as for now i don't have any drugstore primer so i'm just gonna use one of my high-end primer the Frisali. this one right here this small guy right here um to prime okay so this is the only thing that i'm going to use that's not drugstore i hope so <laughs> so for foundation, I am going in with the Fit Me by Maybelline in Mads Plus Poreless in the shade 340. This is like one of my favorite foundation and it's so affordable, like one of the best foundation actually and I love the fact that it's affordable for everyone to get. So you don't have to have like a huge amount of money to hold this baby right here. So you know, that's what I like about it. And it's full coverage. Lightweight, but full coverage. Okay, so to conceal, I'm going in with these two concealers, the Fit Me Maybelline Concealer 
and the LA Girl Pro in Fawn. So my thing, my camera stopped recording. I don't know which parts picked up or not, but I went in with some Makeup Revolution foundation stick as contour. I'm using it to contour. This is in the shade F16. And yeah, so I already applied it onto my face. I'm just about to blend it out. And yeah, I didn't notice this thing just stopped recording. It's trying to play tricks on me and I am not having it, okay? <laughs> so for setting powder, I'm going to go in with the Fit Me, with the Maybelline Fit Me setting powder. in the shade I think this one is in the shade medium like look at that what okay so I guess I'm gonna bake a little bit here and there so as that's baking I'm going to go in with I think this is bronzer this is the Remo London Okay, now so for bronzer, I am going in with the Remo London Stay Matte Press Powder. But I'm gonna use it so bronze. Yeah. The bronzer that I really want is the Makeup Revolution Splendor, Splendor or whatever it is. But they don't sell it here. I have to get it online and God knows how long that's gonna take. Oh, this actually it smells really good. It smells good. Now I am going in with this e.l.f. blush palette. I'm going to use this to blush. These colors are so pretty. You guys, do you see that? Oh my gosh, I'm in love. It's really pretty. So I'm just gonna use, um, I'm gonna go in with like this shade mixed with this. Just to really pigmented. I'm gonna go in with the Milani. It actually smashed badly with the Milani palette. Yeah, Milani palette. This is the, what's the name? Rosie Revenge, Most Wanted. So I'm just gonna go in and kinda like prep my eyes for these beautiful shades that are about to land on it. Okay, so the eyes is prepped. So I feel like I'm gonna do like I'm gonna do like a halo purple pinkish type of mauve type of look thing today.
So yeah, so I'm going in with these lashes right here. Okay guys, so I am basically done. I just went ahead and added some setting spray um, again. So this is basically it. I'm going to wrap it up here. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial as much as I enjoyed making it. Please don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up if you did enjoy it. And also go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Turn on your post notification bell so you are notified whenever I post a video okay you guys go ahead and let me know in the comments what you liked about this look anyway so thank you guys so much for watching i will see you guys on my next one